All right, what is up, guys? It is me, United Scoundrels America, and I am back again from the dead with another video after a month or more. And in this video, I am here to report some brand new news to you guys regarding the alleged Skylanders mobile app predicted to release this August. Basically, you guys, what we have here is the name of the game and a character that is set to be included in the game. The name of the game is Skylanders Ring of Heroes. Here is the official logo for the game. As you guys can see, this is in really good detail, full HD, etc. The background theme for this picture, as you can see, is yellow and orange. While this may not be the official logo or theme colors, it does look super cool. Here is another picture of it with a Skylands background, as it would appear. These both actually happen to be the profile picture and cover art for the official Facebook page for Skylanders Ring of Heroes. Here is a screenshot of their Facebook page, and as you guys can see, these were both added to the page 21 hours ago since this was recorded. Five hours ago, they posted this picture on the page with the caption, Our Facebook page is now open, so let's kick this off right with some spotlights. First up, Eruptor. Alternate awakened form, only available in the new Skylanders Ring of Heroes RPG. Coming soon. Here is the picture, and wow. As you guys can see in this image, we get to see Eruptor with an arrow pointing towards another version of Eruptor that they are calling Alternate. This looks super dope with the dark gray granite colored armor all over him. This makes sense too because if we look up here, we can see that it says Element, Fire, and Class, Defense. So, it seems that we will have a couple of different classes that the specific Skylander will be assigned to. Sounds awesome, whatever it means. So this leaves us with one question. Is this real? Well, as of right now, we have no way of confirming it. I could tell you, I personally think it's legit. The artwork on Eruptor and the logo both look incredible. High enough of a caliber that it just seems like something you couldn't Photoshop or would be so time consuming that you wouldn't want to. The Facebook page seems very legit as well. I could simply say how many likes the page is growing with a half an hour ago, they were at 58 likes and 72 following to, just as I am recording this right now, 63 likes and 78 following. Not to mention two hours ago, when I found out about this, they were in the 30s. Also, this would have taken a lot of pointless dedication and planning to fake this. The first activity on this Facebook page dates back to May 2nd, when the logo was temporarily set to the Calm to Us logo, and the cover art was set to this. Also, on that same date, they posted this, which was just captioned, Test Post, something that wouldn't be thought of most likely if faked. However, make of it what you will, but E3 is in a couple weeks here and it is likely we will hear an official announcement about it there and then. Alright, that is going to wrap it up for this video guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know your thoughts on all this brand new news down in the comments below. I will see you guys in the next video. This is not the last video I am going to be making talking about this subject. I may be doing a live stream this weekend or another video where I'm breaking it down and kind of speculating and kind of going over other stuff that I think and that I can pick out from what we basically saw and maybe if they post anything else on their Facebook page. If anything else happens, I will be making a lot of videos about this as long as we get news and I have stuff to talk about. All right, make sure you guys like and subscribe and don't forget to peace out.